Mario, everyone's been talking about the urgency and having the energy. It was there early in the game. Where, what happened? When did it stop or stall? I don't know. I don't know. It's just it's hard to hard to you know put a finger on it right now. Um, I don't know. We just gotta gotta find a way. Mario, did you take it personally that you guys didn't come back in the fourth quarter? Uh, no, I didn't take it personal. I mean, the second unit was playing well. You know, any any time the second unit goes out and play play well. That's what we want, you know what I mean? So if we have a chance to win down the stretch, I'm pretty sure Coach would have went back with us. But the second unit played well. They came with the energy. Uh, so let them play. Where did you guys struggle defensively in the third quarter? Uh, third quarter, you know, they, they, they got hot. You know, a couple easy baskets in the lane. Uh, a few contested jump shots they made. You know, you got to give it to Philly. They played they play phenomenal. Uh, so, I don't know. Amari, how do you turn this thing around? Because now you go to Chicago, you got a tough stretch coming up. How do you reverse things? Yes, yeah, it's, it's definitely definitely not easy. Um, tough game in Chicago. Uh, a lot of games within this month against you know tough competitive teams. So uh, it's up to us as players to to want to want to do do better out there. We got to we got to still continue to to space the floor offensively. We got to be able to move the ball. Defensively, we just got to make sure we stay within the game plan and, and really work on executing that. What was tough for you? So, I'm sorry, what was tough for you individually tonight? Uh, it was nothing. Nothing. I mean, um, I just take what the defense gives me. So whenever I'm involved, and, then it's, it's trouble for the opposing team. Is there a lack of fight? Coach talked about how you guys didn't respond when you hit a snag tonight. No, I mean, I was, I mean, I, th I think we. Could have put up a better fight. I mean, we could have. We got to do a better job of, of knowing the importance of games. You know, this is a big game for us. You know, conference and divisional uh, team. We got to do a better job of knowing that and and really uh, going after it. You know. So. Yep. How aware are guys overall in the team about you know all these losses? You just keep dropping and teams are catching up in the standings. Yeah, it's not fun. It's definitely definitely not fun. It's something that we got to. Uh, not get used to, you know. I mean, I came here for a reason. I came here to win, you know, and that, and that's something that uh, that's still close to my heart, you know. So we got to find a way to to reestablish ourselves, um, implement our will on opposing teams, play smart basketball, and, uh, and have fun. Right now, we're not having fun. Um, we're just going through the motions right now. So we got to we got to we got to figure a way, figure out a way. Mike mentioned that he didn't feel like his message is resonating. You've been with him for a long time. What do you, what worries you the most about that, that statement? Yeah, I mean he he gives us a game plan, uh, every every game, uh, offensively and defensively, and if we we all all of us, every single player has to buy into it and give the coach a chance to for his strategy to work. Uh, if we don't, then we'll see what happens.